Hi everyone, Leonardo here. Today I'm really excited to walk you through one of the most powerful aspects of the UNOQ, the all-in-one development workflow. UNOQ is not just another board, it's a complete environment where everything comes together. With UNOQ, you can write and upload Arduino sketches to control your hardware, run Python scripts to handle data or automation, and even launch full Linux applications, all in a single place. No more bouncing between different setups or tools. Everything you need is right here, working side by side, so you can go from raw sensor data to real-time control to advanced cloud-connected applications without ever leaving the environment. Traditionally, you had to choose. You could either write Arduino sketches to control hardware in real time, or you had to set up a Linux system for either task like data processing, networking, or running cloud tools. With UNOQ, you no longer need to decide between the two worlds. You get both real-time MCU control and high-level Linux computing, working together in harmony. Here's a typical hybrid project. On one side, a Python script running in the Linux environment is processing the data coming from the external weather service on the Arduino Uno 2 LED matrix. Then we have the brick, which in this example manages the interaction between the board and the weather forecast service. The Python script handles API communication through the brick and data processing, while the Arduino sketch manages LED matrix display. The router bridge enables communication between the microprocessor running the Python script and the microcontroller running the sketch. So, you are seeing the microcontroller taking care of instant display, while the microprocessor handles communication and data management, and it's all linked together seamlessly inside the Arduino App Lab. Okay, now that everything is in place, I want to extend the project as we are just displaying the data. What about to save them locally on a time series database? Okay, let's do it. I duplicate the example and add the time series database brick. It's a database used for storing values over time. The brick exposes some function that I can use straight in my Python script. In just five lines of code, I can tweak the script and store the exact data in I need in the database. That's it. Now my data is saved locally in a structured way. This is the beauty of the all-in-one workflow. I didn't have to leave the environment, juggle between platforms, or waste time configuring. I just kept building on top of what was already there. That's the all-in-one workflow of Uno Q. Sketches and scripts, real-time and high-level computing, all managed through AppLab. It's the simplest, most powerful way to create advanced projects without losing the speed and easy that Arduino is known for. With Uno 2, you don't just code, you manage an entire ecosystem in one place. See you in the next video. Ciao!